Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen and students. I've decided that my next series is going to be logarithms, or logs for short. It sounds complicated, but it's not once you understand the basic idea. Now, before we do that, of course, today's anagram, snooze alarms, rearrange the letters to spell another phrase that makes sense, and I'll reveal the answer at the end of the video. All right, here's the definition of a logarithm. The logarithm to the base of 10 in particular of a number is the exponent. So a logarithm is an exponent. That's all it is. To which the base, which is 10 in this case, must be raised to get that number. So let's apply that definition. What is the log to the base 10 of 1,000? Well, you probably know, and either, either that or you figured out by the definition, it's 3. Since 10 to the 3 equals 1,000. So 3 is the exponent to which the base, which is 10, must be raised to give that number, 1,000. Let's try this one. The log to the base 10 of 0 0.0001. Similarly, that's negative 4 because or since 10 to the negative 4 which is equal to 1 over 10 to the positive 4 if you haven't seen that before just remember that a negative exponent does not produce a negative number it gives you a fraction the negative sign is replaced by the 1 over you keep the 10 you keep the the 4 and of course that is 0 0.0001 now, let's change that to the log to a different base. So instead of the, let's just change that to any. So not 10 anymore. So the logarithm to any base of a number is the exponent to which the base, you know, that particular base must be raised to get that number. Let's do two more examples. So let's do the log, let's say to the base 7 of 343. Can you figure that one out without a calculator especially? Whoops, <laughs> I don't want the equal sign there, sorry. The log to the base 7 of 343 is equal to 3 since 7 to the 3 is 343. 7 squared is 49. 49 times 7 is 343. How about this one? The log to the base 2 of 4096. You'll probably recognize that number as a power of 2, it's often called 4k because it's approximately 4,000. Well, that's equal to 12 since 10 to the 12 equals 4,096. So the 12 is the exponent to which the base, whoops, <laughs> the base was 2, must be raised to give that number. And over here, 3 is the exponent to which the base of 7 must be raised to give that number. Now on your calculator, there's probably only two log buttons. One which says log, which is to the base 10, and one which says ln, which is the natural log, or logarithme naturel in French, that's where the ln comes from. That's to the base e. e is a number like pi, it's irrational, never repeats, never ends. It's essentially 2.718 dot dot dot. I have a video where I recite it to close to 100 decimal points. We'll talk more about that later. So if, if it's to the base 7, there's, you have to know some other little formula so that you can use the calculator. And we'll talk about that later as well. Okay, before we finish off, what's the 
rearrangement of snooze alarms. Alas, no more Z's. No more sleep. The alarm wakes you up. Pretty good, eh? All right, we'll see you next time. Take care.